guys and welcome back to my video so today I'm kind of doing I don't know if I'm gonna call this story time or just a chit chat or I don't know but you'll know from the title what I've called it but I just want to because this is not really story time this that well it kind of has that happened to me but it has happened to me but anyways I just wanted to talk about kind of like you know being out here you know trying to grind while she finished university so for me, I kind of, I don't even know how to start this, I kind of just hit that struggle where, um, so like, most, like you go to university so that you can kind of have that upper hand skill or whatever on your CV and it's supposed to like, you know, give you the opportunities that you wouldn't necessarily get straight away if you were if you just went straight into work after school and what i've noticed is pretty much it doesn't really do that because now all employees want is experience they want you to have experience to get a certain job and i'm like that's great but the thing is like some degrees now they provide that experience but yet you still hear back at the bottom trying to work your way up so to me I'm very much like well what was the point of me going to university then I could I, I literally wasted three years of my life to go back to where I was at the beginning what is happening like what is happening because to me I was like I was like oh well if I go to university at least I'll get that up hand and you know I'll be able to get that job straight away not that like you know CEO job but if I did a management degree I'm like I'm like I'm assuming I'm expected to be getting a management role at the end of it but tell me why I've gone back down the food chain and I have to start from the bottom then work my way up so to me I'm very much like well, what was the point of me going to university? I could have just done this, you know, as finished school, went straight into work. Then that way, I would have had three years of experience instead of three years at university, which I still got experience at university because I still had a job, and also with my degree it comes with it a three-year experience. So I still got the experience, but tell me why I'm a, I'm a, tell me why yeah I'm struggling to get a receptionist job. Tell me why I'm struggling to get a retail assistant job because now like other employees they'll be looking at your cv and they'll be like mm, they've got a degree they're too qualified now they're gonna want to pay uh, like us to pay them more if i am applying for your job it's because i'm i want to work for, i want to do that job i'm not be apply i'm not gonna just apply if i don't want to do that job so why tell me like it's kind of like i feel like it's kind of like we get stuck in this cycle where you have, like employees want you to have experience but they're not then they're not willing to give you that experience but then they see your cv and they're like oh you're too qualified so we can't hire you either and it's like well where do i stand then hmm and then you're all sort of forced to be going on to the job center to try and get pay off your bills and stuff like that because no one wants to give you the experience or the job because you're too you either don't have the experience or you're too qualified like what is going on here i don't understand why that's working but then again i i'm not saying like i'm i've got the most knowledge about all of this topic like i don't i'm not saying that i'm just saying what i've experienced and what i feel about this topic and everything like that and it's kind of like it's weird because the pe I see the people that I went to school with and that like now they out here buying houses buying cars and everything and I'm out here come out of university with a degree and I'm just drowning in debt tell me how does that work out it doesn't work out like in my head that that doesn't work out at all so I'm just like okay cool well I'm fucked aren't I I'm just fucked and <laughs> I just I don't know I just feel like sometimes the society like our society don't doesn't really help us out and everything and now we're just getting into the political role and I don't like to talk about political stuff just because I, I feel like I never I don't have enough information about it so I'm just gonna stop it there but yeah that's pretty much it I just wanted to rant pretty much but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what you think about this topic i don't know what i'm gonna call this topic whatever i called it on the video but let me know what you guys think about this topic down below 
Um, let me know if this has happened to you, like if you feel like you're going through this, if you feel like you're in this type of cycle. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't really know what, what else to say. But if you, first of all, before I go, if you want to find out how I got this makeup look and everything, make sure to check out my boyfriend does my voiceover video because that's where I got this makeup from. So he will explain it, how I created it and everything. So make sure you check it out. I will link it down below. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm just going to end it on there. And I'll just see you guys in my next video. Bye.